I am here to talk about C Sharp, but a new thing in C Sharp. If you were teaching someone C Sharp, think about a new user. I'm new to C Sharp. I don't know anything about this language. This looks like something that you might want to do as a first time developer, you know, print hello world to the console. So the code itself, there's a lot going on here that isn't actually the code that you want to introduce people to when they're first starting C Sharp. What's this CS proj file? Oh my God, it's XML. Like why do I have XML in my new language experience that I am trying to teach you? See, there are these other folders that I'm not really sure what they exist for, but they look kind of menacing. So we can do better than this. Like we wanted to make sure that we can simplify this experience for people learning C Sharp for the first time. What if we could just get rid of all this stuff that isn't C sharp. And my first notch into learning C sharp should just be C sharp, right? It shouldn't be anything else. And so now your new console app looks a bit like this. And so then I can tell the person, yeah, you're going to write console dot write line. Hello, C sharp. Great. I've got C sharp. I'm just being exposed to C sharp. I only have to learn about the concepts that I need to accomplish the tasks that I'm trying to do right now as a first time user. Uh, let's go into this folder that I created. We'll clear it out, have a look inside. So here it is. So now what if I could just .NET run that file directly? Now, this is the first time. This is a brand new feel. Look at that. It works. Like, hello, C-sharp. That's kind of cool, right? 